What's up, YouTube? I haven't made a video in a while on my aquariums or any of my fish. Well, here's an update. I've been currently pretty busy uh, drawing out plans for my double 20-gallon stand. Here is uh, the stuff that I'm going to use. I haven't started building it. I don't think I will build it till I have the right drill bit because I cannot uh, go all the way through this 2x4. Sorry, just don't. Um, I got these little L brackets that are going to help. The screws. I'm going to have all the items you possibly need on a little list. The exact design, everything. So if anybody wants to build a uh, two uh, double 20 gallon stand, I'll have a video for you with the information you need. The size, I mean the cost and everything. So far it's under $20. I think it's like $16 so far for everything at like Lowe's. And it's going to cost me maybe... 1610 to be exact. It's gonna cost me at least uh, 1610, and it might be an even 20 with stain and everything. Anyways, here's uh, my 40 gallon. If you guys have noticed, there is hardly any Java moss in there. I bought new fish because I redid everything in my tank. Well, not everything. I cleaned it out because I had the platinum pair in here. I cleaned it out extremely well, and I did a 40% water change. Well, I unplugged my heater and forgot to plug it back in. I put java moss on there, half of it's green, half of it's brown, I'm going to leave it alone. Obviously my fish aren't bothered too much by it, I lost a ton of guppies, so I had to rebuy new ones. The new ones I bought are uh, that male, hopefully I can zoom in and it doesn't mess up, that male right there, yellow tail, and then there's that red one right there, very gorgeous fish by the way. Um, I still have one of the original blacks, um, she's old. I don't think she's going to pop, I think she's just bloated, but this is my uh, my tank. I think what I'm going to do is switch it over to my uh, black side on the, the background on this because I think this, I think it'll make the fish come out better, like uh, the colors will stick out more. That's my Amazon sword, and I have two skunk quarries back there that I thought were really cool, and I picked them up because I didn't have an actual cleaner. I have all these snails that randomly showed up. But yeah, they just got a water change, so um, this is my 40 gallon. I will show you my, there's one of my mills. It's really hard to get a picture of these guys because they're swimming all at the top because I think I'm going to feed them. I will gonna sh I'll show you a uh, my baby angel fish in the, here an update on this next video. So I hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions, I got them at a local pet shop that... Um, the local pet shop actually only sells fish that are bred around here, which is an advantage and disadvantage because then you run into the, they don't have a supply of a certain kind of fish, but their, their quality and stock, I would have to say, is way better than going to like a Petco or a PetSmart. But if you guys have any questions or comments about this, or if you have any information over why she's fat and does not have any babies, um, any suggestions or anything like that, I would, uh, hey, there's a baby guppy right down there. Ah, uh, come on, come on. Well, it's right underneath that rock. Sorry, I just noticed it. Um, but if you guys have any questions or comments, feel free to ask. Alright, thanks.